Greetings and salutations, and welcome back to our Let's Play of U4 with Red Bastard. And where we last left off our Scotland campaign, we were getting ready to invade this New World nation and their ally over here. We're in a war against Austria at the moment, but the only assistance we are giving is naval assistance, because our manpower is low. And we don't want France to get unmanageably large, because the whole point of the campaign is to be able to bring them down. and eventually get them as a vassal. Now there is another way of getting this. We could get a personal union over them at some point, integrate them in, and release France as a vassal, either in whole or in part. Okay, let's go ahead and just declare this war. And I'm not sure if... Yeah, I really don't want to fight their allies at the moment. So just going to declare it. We don't need to worry about aggressive expansion. So since we have a colonist or um, a conquistador, we can actually move onto their land without getting oh, nice. Now let me figure out what I want to name that. As I was saying, um, we don't get exiled when we declare that war. Okay, so it's this region, but not this stuff up here. Oh, this is part of it. But this is separate. So we're going to have to try getting a fifth province up here and seeing what happens. Okay, what do we want to name this? Let's see, where's... Nice, we're settling. Okay, I like Tac Tac. This is going to be... Scottish... Tech Tech. Actually, I really should name them after after subscribers. Yeah, I'm gonna reward you guys. Um, let's see if anyone's got a great name that would be well suited for the name of Colony. Must be just one second. Okay. Well, we do have a subscriber. His name is Daka Daka. So I think what we'll do is go Daka instead of repeating that. Daka Tak Tak. I mean, that sounds good, doesn't it? That does sound good. Tech attack, tech. Should we make it one word or two? Well, let's do it that way. Tech attack, tech. There you go. That works for me. I can live with that. Okay, we only need 4,000 trips here, so we're going to leave these three and a couple cannons. One guy behind. And our trips are kind of garbage and we'll have to cross there, so why don't we actually wait? Sad that I have to worry about this. Evangelical Union. I don't know if we'll take a side. We'll see how things start to shape up. Okay, Savoy. Let's take a look at what's going on in Savoy. 
Burrows got a 67 year old, we could potentially get a union over them. There are only two provinces more already over our limits, so I'm not sure that that's a great idea. Um, he's 50. On Spock is he an elector? We'll have to check. I mean, he obviously isn't one of the starting electors, but you never know. Liege 56. That's always possible. That's two provinces and would give us the opportunity to try expanding up here, potentially. So he's 53. And we'll hope for the best here. Okay, so... Do you guys have cores? They don't have any cores, so we can feed them back. And what we're looking at? Electors. Okay, so Trier was... No, who was eliminated? Uh, Mainz. Mainz is one of the starting ones. They were eliminated and probably had their land returned, but Munster was given their electorate. Let's just take a look how this is shaping up. So we see Spain and Hungary on one side, and the Commonwealth on the other. So yeah, two of our allies are here, and one's there. So we can't really join in. I'm hoping that the Catholics win without us having to get involved, and that we become competitive for the throne. We have one vote here. Let's see if we could actually encourage more people to vote for us. And I'd love to get our legitimacy higher. But I can't justify doing so yet. Not until we get caught up on tech. Let's just check to see if they have any debt. Nope. You never know. With them not having everything cored or uh, converted, it could lead to some problems. You know, financial problems. I could hire, you know, Inquisitor or somebody. Okay, so Hesse was knocked out of the war. We uh, made some cash off of it. Not much. Yeah, let's go ahead and do this. I want that plus 10% tax modifier. Okay, we've got a claim here. like to fabricate one here, but we've got a few things that we need our guys to be doing. Uh, we'll do this for a little bit longer because that clergy is going to become disloyal from not having enough land. We can give them some cash, but obviously we're not in the best financial position at the moment. They'll become loyal again soon. And wait till we get military tech 12. And then we'll try to catch up some more. We don't need a larger force limit at the moment. Okay, yeah, they will get upset. 18 over extension. That is surprising because they were nomadic and they were moving around, but apparently they developed this a little bit. And then moved away and moved back. Yeah, they developed this too. That's 
and this. It would be fun to colonize those places. And let's go ahead and get some stability. We got a free merchant. Let's see how this trade flows. Okay, we haven't located this yet, so we're going to have to march around with this guy and try to find the center. Let's do that. Oh, he is actually going to move around this continent. Okay, why don't we go ahead and fabricate down here. Where do you have a claim on that province? Oh, lost our conquistador. And he's got two siege, so I do like the replacement. I worry that we might need a few more infantry. There will be a number of, of nations on this defender side. Okay, who else could we potentially get? Okay, we lost that one. Let's top off these relations. I think the Commonwealth is actually trying to befriend everyone. It's strange, is France in two different wars? It must be. Now, okay, how are we able... Oh, we can set them as friendly, we just can't improve relations. Yeah, don't mind me. Coffee boom. That definitely helps the Ottomans out. I would think nothing of our contribution, France. We're just your loyal allies, doing our part in your war effort. So we should top off relations with France since we had that event that lost us some, some relations. And we don't have super high legitimacy. Sure, take that. Ooh. They moved over here. Okay. That'll make our job easier, because we can isolate them. Now we don't need any more troops. We can hit this group and just leave one unit behind, beat up on them. Just to stop, you know, any construction of new troops, move over here, wipe them out, despite them having a cool skull flag. I think the center of trade is going to be somewhere up here. Just judging by where we can see these lines. No, it's that right there. Don't mind me. Let's transfer this trade power. Um. Yeah, we want tariffs. We can just develop them to get 
Third Liberty Desire down if we need to. But we're hurting economically. Okay, let's get to work over here. As soon as we get through this province. Ah. Well, let's just march straight through the... Uh, we do want those events to trigger. So we'll do the hunt for the seven cities right after we conquer this stuff. Okay, now we can start. Fabricating claims on everyone now it's here. Like these guys. Our relationship with France is probably going to suffer as they try to colonize more of this. Hopefully they won't do any more in this region. I'm just waiting for a diplomat back, and then we'll declare this war. On the first of the month. Okay, let's go ahead and... We have no CB. I guess we'll declare on you instead. Hmm, who's your ally? I don't know where they are. Okay, let's go over there. I guess we have to... We had a claim on them, and then they moved. Yeah, I'm not even sure where they could be. It doesn't look like they'd be hidden up here. Maybe it's somewhere in here that we can't see? It just seems strange that they would be able to get that alliance. Okay, let's go ahead and switch out these troops. We'll go for free shooters. Okay, there you are. The admin, or 250 ducats. Let's go for the admin. We can always get money, you know, beating up on natives or something. Not that we would do something like that. Okay, so France joined the League. Yeah, the Protestants have the upper hand, but they do have Spain and Russia on the Catholic side. Who knows how this would turn out. Nice. Like that. I can't imagine that they would peace out yet. But it was worth a shot. Okay, so we need to do a landing over here. Hopefully it'll wipe out their troops. Okay, we're going to fabricate a claim over here. We've got this one. We have a claim here. I mean, we could fabricate in some of their other stuff. And for the moment, that seems like a pretty good idea. Chase him, chase him, chase him down. Okay, 
Okay, they're probably going to get away because we have to cut through all this territory that we haven't explored. So we're moving more slowly. Worky. I like that. Okay, so we could... Yeah, no, the burgers are fine. We can't give them 3%. Another 11 years. That's going to be a problem. Okay, I think we're just going to have to siege out their province here, piece them out for their money, and come back for them later. Otherwise, we're going to be running around playing whack-a-mole. Did our subject lose their troops? Looks like it. I think they only had like one unit. And we do have some spy power, so let's see if we can put that to use. Yep. Chase him down. Yeah, we wouldn't be able to annex him. We don't have a land route there to be able to core him anyway. So we'll just we'll just piece him out. Um, that'd be worth a little bit of prestige, so we'll do it now. It's going to create a longer truce, so I'm not interested in that. Two more accepted cultures. Let's get Breton. And Francian. Yeah, they have a claim there. And they have more than one province. They're not nomadic. They can't migrate anywhere else. They have to take their cash. We'll upset some people. But no one's going to be able to do anything about it. Yeah, is that so? Cat is suggesting they should go and watch Netflix with him. But uh, we've got stuff to do here first. Uh, Russia. Russia, you are now our rival. Yep, I'm going to disregard that suggestion. And I'm going to embargo them anyway. Cat is a Russian nationalist. And he was offended. Not me, him threatening sanctions on Russia. But I will not be dissuaded. Okay. Kyo Kappa, that should be these guys down here. Yeah, let's just wait for the first of the month here, as usual. We're going to mark them as co belligerent. Way, hopefully, we can annex both of these people. Okay, what do they got? 25k. So that means that we can't leave behind enough to siege this out.
And we probably should get some mercs. We got a tech advantage. We've got a good general. Oh, they can move down here. Let's block these straights. Make sure that doesn't happen. Ooh, they're going for it. Not quite the plan. Okay. Defensive planner, that's really useful. It's good that I did buy those mercs, because their numbers almost drowned us. We definitely have this war now. Let's fight those mountains. All I have to do is just get the stag wipe and we'll spread out and carpet siege them. Okay. Everything is proceeding exactly as planned. Send these guys over there. Leave that guy behind. Send these guys up here. Uh, that should do it. I believe these transports here for the blockade value, and then we'll move them down south. Ottomans, um, so they clearly went for exploration. I bet that they'll beat us to the Spice Islands and Australia, because obviously we're not moving in that direction right now. Shouldn't pay for those guys. Okay, what do we want to do? I think we want to get some more stuff up here. We'll just leave that guy there for the moment. I'll just move everyone onto here. Get rid of those mercs for the sake of our economy. And this siege shouldn't take long. It, it's a negligible drain on our manpower. Ew. Um, that's just five years, but we lose a stability. We're losing a stability anyway. So do we want to lose a stability and get unrest, or lose a stability and gain papal influence? I mean, I guess we'll lose a stability and gain papal influence. That will help us to restore. Um, let's go ahead and get their loyalty back up. We are not issuing any peace at this time. That's weird, Pathram. Uh, 
Okay, that's definitely a visual bug. That's showing blockade, so we'll assume that it's working as intended. Let me just keep an eye on our video. Yeah, we're 30 minutes in. So let's go ahead and stop this video here.